and it's it's so funny. I I would actually credit um, Macklemore's music was a lot of what brought my ability to find sobriety easily um, through his music. Listening to it, you know, even. I went to a very expensive treatment center and they were wonderful. Oh, I learned so much. I loved it. But it was really through connecting to his music that I was able to go, wait, I can do this. And he gets it. He gets it. Um, so that, that, that was a big, he was a big savior for me for sure. So if you can say anything to Mac Lamar right now, what would it be? Um, oh, so much, but he <laughs> saved my soul in so many ways, starting with sobriety. Um, and then actually I would say what actually made me, his music helped me find an ability to get sober. But then later his music um, kind of helped me find faith. I never had faith in my life before, you know, um, and a big part of finding sobriety, unfortunately, sometimes faith has to come with that. That's what scared me a lot. I shied away from AA because of the whole God thing scared me. Um, but after, you know, getting sober and Macklemore's music doing that, he also, again, brought me to the ability to see that there was something bigger. And his number one thing that he sings about that I would love to say to him and thank him for is he sings about our ego. What banished my darkness, I would say, was the ability to recognize my ego, recognize that my ego, what was that was what was keeping me sick.